Hello, this is Don Anders. And in this video series, we're going over some of the investments that we really like at the end of 2023, beginning of 2024. Uh, and in the last video, we talked about fixed accounts. So if you haven't seen that video and you're interested in just straight fixed accounts, we talked about how it's kind of the golden age for those. I'm gonna go ahead and link that up above. Uh, but in this video, we're going to talk about fixed indexed accounts. Okay, so if you've watched my videos in the past, if you attended our webinars or anything else, you've heard us talk about fixed index accounts and they are quickly becoming some of the most popular options for people who are retiring. So what a fixed index account does, and they can either be annuities or CDs. Um, some people do fixed uh, indexed with, uh, that are, that are you know, fee-based and things like that. But what a fixed index account does is it gives you a floor the minimum you can make, which is typically 1%, and it gives you a cap, the most you can make, which right now, there are accounts that are paying over 12% caps. Now, some people, the very conservative ones of you who are watching, say, well, Don, you were just talking about 6% guaranteed in the other video. So why would I go with an account that could make as little as one? Well, if you want just the highest guaranteed minimum interest rate, go with the 6% account, fine. But these accounts are for people who say, you know what, I like the idea of participating in the market because that's what it fluctuates by. Typically the S&P 500, sometimes there's other you know, weird ones that are out there, but typically the S&P 500, I like ones that participate, I want to participate in the market, but I don't want the risk. Uh, if if the market drops by 40%, I want to guarantee that I at least make 1% that year. If the market goes up by 40%, I'm okay with make, only making 12. I just don't want to lose money. So if you're one of those people who say, I like the idea of the market, but I don't like the idea of the risk, then the fixed index is a pretty good option because you, your principal is guaranteed. You can't lose money on it uh, unless you add a bunch of fees or something, which I don't recommend. Um, but you have the option to make more. Now, if you look at the historic stock market, now, once again, I gotta remind people, just because something happened in the past doesn't mean it will happen in the future. But if you look at the historic stock market returns, the market is typically up, the S&P 500 is typically up eight out of 10 years. That's 80% of the time. So if you look at a 12% cap over a 10 year period, typically that is going to outperform a 6% guarantee. Now it's not guaranteed, right? It could be lower, but typically you're going to see a higher return on those types of accounts. Now, what's the downfall of this? Well, these accounts are long-term accounts. So you're, you're looking at anywhere from three years up to 10 years of a time commitment in these accounts. Now you can take out 10% a year, but you really want to leave them there and let them grow. So this is for somebody who says, Don, I just want to put this money away. I don't want to think about it for right now. And I want it to grow. Uh, if you've watched our three bucket approach video, you'll know that we recommend always having plenty of money that's liquid and available. So that would be your bucket one. This would be more for bucket two or bucket three, depending on how you want to structure it. So if you're looking for guarantee and if you're looking for growth, these are a really good option. The other thing is, if you have one of these accounts and you set it up prior to 2022, you probably want to review it, okay? Because in 2021 and 2020 and before then, your caps were 3, 4, 5, 6% max, maybe 7% if it was if you had like perfect timing, but but usually we're seeing 3 and 4% caps from that time period. And even if you're within the, you know, your, your 10 year window, remember you can take 10% out. So you could take 10% and move it over to a higher paying one that works the same way. Think about it. Uh, if, if it's something that you're interested in, as always, there's a link down below. You can subscribe, uh, there, you can, you can book an appointment. Also, please subscribe. It helps show these videos to people like you, uh, and, and like the video. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. We'll talk soon. Thanks. Bye.